Welcome to your new iPlayer 4. Let's take a look at how to set up your iPlayer. When you first turn on your device, you'll be prompted to create a password. Your password must be secure, with at least 10 characters, one uppercase letter, lowercase letters, one number, and one special character. Once you've set up your password, you can log in for the first time. Now that you're logged in, you'll see details about your device, a top bar menu with options to choose from, and a list of available applications. You can even rename your device to something more personal. Let's take a closer look at the settings menu. From here, you can adjust basic information, reboot options, and set up date, time, and location settings. You can also customize your network and lighting settings, establish a connection with your Interact account, and choose which color processing algorithm you'd like your iPlayer to output to your fixtures. The Applications tab contains all the different APIs used on your iPlayer. If needed, the status of APIs can be checked and restarted. The Logs tab has information about the system and logs from past sessions. This data can be viewed live or downloaded over a segment of time. On the License page, you can view your current license, update or upgrade to a newer license. Finally, the Firmware page is where you can review the version you currently have loaded on your device and the release notes that are associated with it. You can also boot into recovery mode or flash a new firmware file if necessary. And that's it. With the iPlayer, you have complete control over your lighting system in one easy-to-use device. Visit our website to learn more or contact customer support if you have any questions.